Hello learners, welcome back to our YouTube channel, Robo Army. Today, we are going to make an exciting project, Smart Dustbin. Imagine a dustbin that opens automatically when you approach it. Thanks to ultrasonic sensor technology and a servo motor controlled by Arduino. Let's, before we begin, let's take a quick look at what we need for this project. First, we have the Arduino board. This is the brain of our project. It's a microcontroller that we'll be programming to read data from the ultrasonic sensor and control the servo motor. Next, we have the ultrasonic sensor. This little device uses sound waves to measure distance. It has two main components, the transmitter, which emits ultrasonic pulses, and the receiver, which detects the reflected pulses. Up next, we have the servo motor. This motor is perfect for our project because it allows precise control of angular rotation. We'll be using it to open and close the lid of our dustbin. Then, one USB cable to upload code to our Arduino board. Some jumper wires. A double battery holder with a DC power jack and switch. And two lithium ion cells. At last, a standard dustbin that will be our canvas for transforming into a smart device. Okay, so we have understood our components. Let's start building our smart dustbin. First, we have to wire up the ultrasonic sensor with male to female wires. Then, we'll connect the VCC and GND pins of the ultrasonic sensor to the 5 volts and GND pins on the Arduino, respectively. The trig pin of the sensor goes to any of the Arduino's digital pins. Here I am connecting it to pin number 9 and the echo pin to digital pin 10. Then connect male to male jumper wires to the servo motor. As for the servo motor, we connect its VCC and GND pins to the 5 volts and GND pins on the Arduino respectively and the signal pin to digital pin 11. Verify your connections according to this circuit diagram. With our circuit setup, it's time to write some code. Download the code file by using the link provided in the description below. Now open the file if you've already downloaded the Arduino IDE, otherwise download the Arduino IDE first. Here you can see we have included the servo library, as we'll be using it to control the servo motor. Then, we have defined the pins for the ultrasonic sensor and the servo motor. In the setup function, we have initialized the serial communication and attached the servo motor to its pin. Finally, in the loop function, we'll read data from the ultrasonic sensor and use it to control the servo motor. You can also change the parameters as you wish. Now upload the code by following some instructions. Connect the Arduino UNO to your computer using a USB cable. Then, go to the tools, then port and select port. Then go to boards in the same menu and select Arduino UNO. Now upload the code by clicking the upload button. You can see, the sketch is first verified by the compiler and then uploaded to the Arduino. It's time to check that our circuit is working or not. When the sensor detects an object within 20 cm, as we have programmed it, it sends a signal to the Arduino. The Arduino then commands the servo motor to rotate 90 degrees, basically to open the lid of the dustbin. After one second delay to allow time to deposit the trash, the servo motor rotates back to zero degrees, closing the lid automatically. So, this will be the way our smart dustbin works. Now take a dustbin and a lid of cardboard or any suitable material you want. And then, install the circuit as shown. And power the Arduino by using your battery pack via DC power jack. Our smart dustbin is up and running. Now, Every time someone approaches the dustbin, the lid opens automatically, allowing for hands-free waste disposal. With a little bit of coding and wiring, you can create your own smart home solutions. 
Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more DIYs.